Welcome back, everybody. <laughs> and it, Chucky's our co-star today. Yeah. Oh, never mind. No. <laughs> okay, today we're going to do uh, another one of these Discovery Kid kits. We are. Uh, Jill Ann is my co-star for right now. So am I, Chucky. And um, so this is the thing to grow your own crystals. Um, this will be kind of a series. We're going to, uh, I'm going to start them with her. And then she's going to update you guys on how they go. Um, but what is in the container, the little box is your, I push a box. Two little rocks. A lot of containers. I know there was a stirring stick in there. It's stuck. A I stirring it stick. It even tells you that you can mix it up with it. Mm. Like we need that information. And then this little crystal uh, growing like chemicals. Crystal. And then your instructions. So it says first final level area to Form your experiment. Cover your cover with newspaper or paper towels. You will need a measuring cup, a wooden mixing stick included in the kit to help, and the help of a adult lab partner. Have your lab partner fill one fourth of a measuring cup halfway with hot water. Open your bag of crystal mix and pour three-fourths of it into your measuring cup. It's kind of crazy. Okay. Yeah, it is. So, I got to go get a measuring cup. Okay. She's so, we're going to put... One fourth of cup of hot water in here. I don't really know how you're going to do that because you would have to have a bigger cup than that. So let's see if I can get over here transferred into the half a cup. Okay. So then you're supposed to take three fourths of this. And put it in the mixture. Don't ask me why it's only three fourths when you put it in the bag. But uh, there's a whole bag. No, no. I don't think they can see it because of the jar. Sorry, y'all. Are you going to put the whole thing in? And that looks like about three-fourths to me. <laughs> eyeball it. Eyeball well, it. you have to eyeball it. It don't tell you what three-fourths is. They should like, you know, mix that up. Okay, they should like put a little line. They should put a little line on the packet. I don't see why you don't use the whole packet. Oh, look, it's dying the stick blue. <coughs> Well, okay, it. take a crystal display tray and place it on your work surface. Then place both rocks into the tray. Wait, which one then? They give you two. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, maybe we like divide the water? Uh, yeah, you can. And can then, you one? it's just take, I don't know, it's just take, place both rocks into it. Into the tray. What show? Well, why do they give you two the then? Tray. Why do they give you two then? I don't know. Maybe to separate the crystals if you want to do one for someone and one for you. <laughs> Place. They don't give you enough information. Okay. Take take a crystal display tray and put it put it on your work surface and place both base rocks into the tray. Pour slow. Slowly pour the crystal mixture onto the tray over the base mm -hmm. rocks. Using the measuring stick, stir contents until completely combined. The liquid crystal mi mixture 
should reach halfway up your base rock. Look at this. What time is it? It's blue. It, it showed the circle tray. I don't know because I don't know, I understand why it gives you two trays. Can Chucky stir it? You're only supposed to use one. Okay. Okay, Dylan. Okay. Put the box and one of the trays. I think we should put it in square. I think we should put one of them in there. And then just, like, add the rest of the... Just, just, just put one in there. We're following the instructions. Fine. To put that one in there. Thank you. Hold on, I'm going to put that in there. Middle. And then it says to pour the con pour the contents in there. Yeah. Good job, Chucky. And now what? And then to stir it up. Now what? And Don't then <laughs> Evenly sprinkle your remaining crystal growing compound on top. They really need to label this stuff. Either so that or give more detail. I guess you sprinkle this crap over the top of this crap. Right like that. It said the rest of it doing the rest. And then it says Helpful tip, cover your tray with paper towel with paper towel this will help your crystal mixture evaporate and turn into a crystallized form. Your crystal should start growing within three to seven days. Make sure to keep records of your crystal growth. Use the second tray to display crystal from second rock. Huh? Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, um, uh, maybe we take the rocks out and put it in here and then sprinkle the stuff on top. No. They need to get more information and label this crap. It takes a whole week. Anyway, it says to take and cover it up with a paper towel. So we'll take and cover it up with a paper towel, and Jillian will update you guys on how this is working out in like three days. We've tried this once before it failed miserably. Yeah, it's in the gun. Yeah. So we'll figure out how that goes. So as always guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And we will up uh, Jillian will update you on how this goes. Or she doesn't have it. Bye.